Well, Hollywood is a happening place right now. The Oscar nominations, of course, just announced, and the Critics' Choice Awards are tonight. Tiffany and Ryan Jay escaped this Wisconsin winner, and now they are joining us from sunny California with the preview of tonight's ceremony. Good morning, guys. Good morning, Molly. We're so excited. We are here at the Critics' Choice, and I'm so excited to be with our resident film critic, Ryan Jay. You heard the Oscars came out this morning, right? I absolutely did. There's some, there's some really, I think, expected choices, but there, there are a few important snubs, too. Yeah, Ryan. It's true. I, th I found it very interesting that American Sniper got some Oscar love, as did Bradley Cooper for that film, and then Unbroken and Angelina Jolie, which is nominated tonight here at our Critics' Choice Movie Awards show, was not nominated at the Oscars. But I think it's really indicative for awards season overall this year, which is that unlike last year, where everything was a clean sweep for all actors in all categories at all awards shows and movies, it's, gonna, it's not going to happen this year. This year it's going to be different movies and different actors winning different categories and different shows. Yeah, so overall, would you say you were surprised? Yeah, I want to show you the room, Molly, because we are here on the set. So I don't know. Can you see behind us? This is the set of the Palladium where the show is going to be tonight. We're right in Hollywood. And I'm going to show you who some of the celebrities are. So let's take a look, okay? Are you ready for this? Yeah, I'm ready. Uh, your favorite, Molly, it's Angelina Jolie. She's going to be sitting right here, right up front. You're going to be able to see her. Might come say hi during one of the breaks. Right back there is Oprah again. Opie, going to go say hi to her. Over here, one of my favorites. I know it's one of yours. We think she's America's sweetheart. Reese Witherspoon is going to be sitting there. We're just right behind the Lego movie on the other side. So when you watch the show, you'll be able to kind of watch for us back there. But I can't even tell you how grateful I am and excited I am to be here with Ryan. If I'm excited, I know you're excited. What are you so excited? about always excited this is the highlight of my year every year it's like the most incredible annual experience you know if you are a movie lover like me you get excited as I always have growing up watching the Oscars but to actually get to attend an awards show is just it's like Christmas every year yeah I believe that and you know people go to your movie clubs they know you that you do our, our resident film critic stuff and this is the critics choice how do you get to be here what does it mean to be a critic well, it's a great honor. I'm a member of a really great organization called the Broadcast Film Critics Association, and we have about 300 members or so uh, throughout the country, and we get to vote for this particular awards show, which is really exciting because, you know, after all year long, paying, paying attention to the, the movies, picking out the ones that are your favorites, and not actually having the chance to write in who should be nominated and then actually vote for the winners tonight is really an exciting experience. Well, I was here last year with you, and it was so neat because there's so many celebrities. You're so close. What do you think makes this show unique? What I love most about watching the Critics' Choice Movie Awards in comparison to, like, the Golden Globes or the Oscars is that we have more of the categories that you at home and I really care about. You know, in, in a, we have more acting categories, so we do more movie categories. There's a Best Picture Comedy, Best Picture Action Film, Best Sci-Fi Horror Movie. We also have Best Actor and Actress in a Comedy Film, Best Actor and Actress in an Action Film. So we get a lot more stars here because there are a lot more people nominated. There's so many stars here, Molly. Is there anybody that you, like, who's your favorite? Mark Ruffalo is my favorite. I wonder if he's going to be there tonight. He, he should be here, a Kenosha boy. Yeah, we're excited for that. Um, are you excited to see what we're wearing tonight? That's my biggest question is what you're wearing, because last year you knocked it out of the park with that red dress. I know. Last year I did rent I'm the just, I'm just hoping Tiffany and I don't show up in the same dress. <laughs> <laughs> he's, not wear he's wearing my red dress from last year. Yeah. You're going to have to watch us tonight to see what we're wearing, Molly, but it's, it's going to be really great. The show's tonight. The show is tonight on A&E at 8 p.m. Really excited to see that later. You guys have a blast. Look your absolute best tonight and have a really good time. Thank you so much. We will. We'll post pictures, videos, we'll tweet. We'll, we'll keep in touch, so watch us. Instagram, Facebook, all of it, everything. Awesome. Thanks again, you guys, and have a great time in California. And remember to check out Ryan's website. It is ryanjreviews.com.